They came face to face with a cassowary and it had no intention of moving on. What prompted such a desperate call to 911? It was a vicious physical attack, not from a human being, but from a bird. Bears, sharks, and piranhas are known for being scary, but there are other animals that are even more dangerous than you'd think. It's really surprising how dangerous some animals can be. These animals are more dangerous than you might expect. Number six, shrews. Shrews are small and gray in appearance, but one of the most ferocious animal predators in the world. They are found on five continents and in a range of environments, making them very common. The northern short-tailed shrew is particularly common in eastern North America. You might have seen videos on YouTube showing shrews fighting and defeating mice, scorpions, snakes, and other larger animals. This is because several shrew species are venomous. A single shrew can store enough venom to kill up to 200 mice. The venom is stored in a gland that allows it to mix with saliva, which is then released into the victim when the shrew bites it. The venom paralyzes the victim, but it does not kill it. The shrew then stores the paralyzed victim as a food source for later use. According to the American Chemical Society, a paralyzed mealworm can be kept alive for up to 15 days. Although the shrew bite is unpleasant, it disappears after a few days, and humans are not in danger as shrews are small creatures. Number 5. The Cassowary because birds are now recognized to be a direct descendant of dinosaurs. Experts believe that most of them were feathered rather than scaly, like current reptiles. If there's one species that seems to support this notion, it's the Australian cassowary, which is unquestionably the most dinosaur-like creature still alive on the planet. The world's most deadly bird, as it is known, is cautious towards people and domestic dogs, but won't hesitate to strike violently if it finds it necessary. With a strong pecking beak and incredibly sharp claws, the blows may actually be quite ferocious. Deaths have been reported, but they're actually uncommon. <coughs> Cassowary will attack automobiles and their own reflections in a pane of glass, which causes them to shatter, possibly implying that they too acquired a pea brain from the dinosaurs. However, these scaled-down velociraptors are not immune to threats, and the Australian rainforest now features only about 2,000 individuals because their habitat was decimated by the introduction of 24 million invasive domestic pigs, which have already caused 100 extinctions of native flora and fauna in Australia. So, it's actually possible that now is the time to step in and save the classic angry bird from oblivion. Number 4. Swan. A guy drowned after a swan attacked him, knocking him out of his kayak and preventing him from swimming to land. How dangerous can these beautiful white birds be? Anthony Hensley, a 37-year-old man, worked for a company that used swans to prevent geese from entering private lands. On a Saturday morning, he paddled across a pond at a residential development in De Plain, Illinois to attend to the swans. He was a married man with two children. Now according to Cook County Sheriff Tom Dart, whose officers handled the tragedy, one of the swans rushed his boat, capsizing it. Mr. Hensley attempted to swim to shore, but eyewitnesses report to the sheriff's detectives that the swan aggressively impeded him. The swan's violent behavior, according to ornithologists, is typical of the species the moose swan, while guarding a nest. Males defend their nests fiercely, especially during the spring nesting season, which runs from April to June. Number three, beaver. The beaver is known as the forest's friendly little lumberjack and is known for his magnificent dams across rivers. This is somewhat accurate. These nocturnal, semi-aquatic rodents are among the nature's great constructors, and there are two kinds that reside in North America and Eurasia. The beaver creates its dam to provide a tranquil pool in which to dwell, and as a result, has acquired extraordinary abilities as a woodworker, able to bring down enormous branches and logs, as well as to construct canals in order to transfer the material to the dam. The beaver's huge teeth are used for the majority of their amazing job, and this is where things may turn dangerous for humans. 
In 2013, a Belarusian man approached a beaver with his camera intending to take a picture of it. However, the camera she beaver didn't really appreciate that and dug his teeth into the guy severing an artery and causing him to die in agony. In 2018, another guy would be kayaking with his daughter in Pennsylvania. While on a boat trip, a beaver suddenly jumped into the boat and began attacking the passengers. One of the passengers used a paddle to hit the beaver, but it then turned its attention to the passenger's daughter. Eventually, the father was able to beat the persistent beaver to death. It is important to note that the beaver's large orange incisors are intended for biting through solid wood, so it is important to be cautious if you encounter one and it seems to be using you as a potential source of building material for its dam. Number 2. The Sea Lion a viral video of a California sea lion grabbing a young girl off the pier in Vancouver vicinity has aroused interest in the marine creatures, as well as some misunderstandings at a pier in British Columbia, Canada. A sea lion can be seen rushing out of the ocean and then pulling a young girl into the port by her clothing. Although it was most likely out of curiosity, people can nonetheless be harmed by these games. Sea lions as beautiful and cuddly as they may look should be recognized as wild creatures and handled with respect, which includes keeping a safe distance. When confronted by people, they prefer to flee, but if they do find themselves in precarious situations, they're prepared to bite. It's worth noting that male sea lions are fiercely territorial during mating season, and they've been known to attack humans who come too close to them. This is due to the fact that their bodies contain larger quantities of certain hormones, and they're also attempting to defend their claimed territory in order to recruit a large number of females into their harem. Now we have to keep in mind that as we continue to enter into sea lions' native environments, we're exposing them to new and unfamiliar situations. They have innate instincts that will guide them in their actions because people continue to push the boundaries that were previously in place and we can't expect them or any other creature for that matter to change that. It's also not really fair to lump all people into the same category when an emergency situation arises. Thousands of individuals give up their time to help. Many sea lions would perish if it weren't for the assistance when oil spills or other issues occur in their natural environment as a result of human negligence. Number one, the lionfish. The lionfish is a type of scorpion fish and it's a ferocious one at that. With a the lionfish is a stunningly beautiful fish with red, white, and black stripes across its body. However, it is also extremely dangerous, with an array of poisonous spines radiating from it. The fish is a formidable fighter and an excellent hunter, with a voracious appetite for anything small enough to fit inside its jaws. It has no natural predators in its native environment, which includes the reefs, corals, and lagoons of the South Pacific and Indian Oceans. Although lionfish numbers are mostly kept under control, they have become one of the most destructive invasive species after escaping into the Caribbean from an aquarium destroyed by Hurricane Andrew in 1992. Lionfish aggressively feast on unsuspecting local species and can grow to considerably larger sizes than previously reported. They have already spread throughout the Western Atlantic, leaving a path of destruction in their wake. Environmentalists are working to stop this invincible fish from spreading any further. Animals can be tricky to read, and sometimes they can be downright dangerous. Being deceived by their appearance can lead to deadly consequences. Out of all the wild creatures out there, which one would you be least willing to encounter? Would such an incident make you more cautious when exploring nature? Please share your thoughts in the comments section below. Also, make sure to check out the other interesting content on the screen. See you next time.